Eutrophication is the process of phosphorus and particulate matter and nitrogen up in your lakes. Which comes from people's yards and, and storm drains, which which is not filtered, by the way, which it should be. The Lake Mackintyre watershed is very eutrophied. Lake Mackintyre watershed is very eutrophied. Lake Mackintyre water is very eutrophied. Now. now! How will I know that I'm being eutrophied? Eutrophication is something that we all need to worry about and be aware of in our, our own local environment. Indeed, Lake Makatawa is experiencing eutrophication and has been for a long time. It's an environmental issue that we need to be aware of and we need to stare in the face and understand. And that's why we're here to tell you about eutrophication. Now! now! The eutrophication that comes from Lake Makatawa comes from the drainages and feeder creeks and tributaries and storm drains that are around Lake Makatawa. It's something we like to call runoff, kids. So that phosphorus going going into the water. Now. now. So, Kellen, what's what's uh, eutrophication caused by? Eutrophication is caused by a lot of things. It's caused by you got you got your true green, you got your Roundup. It's putting phosphorus, nitrogen, particulate matters in the ground runoff, the war in Iraq. It's it's an it's an environmental issue, and you know what? You got to be aware of it. And your Roundup and your True Green and your Democrats are killing the lake. They're killing the ozone. Killing the fish. And they're killing... How does this affect the fish in the lakes? Our lakes are no longer pure. I heard, uh... What we're losing to... oxygen. We're losing fish. We're losing life, people. Now. now! Now, why exactly am I so worried about algae in my pond over here called Lake McTow? Why am I so worried about you, Trophicate? Jared? Sure. Well, basically, Kellen, uh, eutrophication caused by the phosphorus and nitrates get in the water, and the algae comes in, and the algae takes all the oxygen up, and the fish, fish suffer no. that. No, no, it's, it's it's not the algae. The algae makes the oxygen. You're wrong. You're wrong. It's the decomposers that consume the oxygen. Oh. What are they doing? Now. now. So so how does eutrophication in the lake affect me? You tell me, Sonny. You tell me, can you fish this lake anymore? I no, you can't. You can't fish this lake. I, my grandpappy took me to that lake about ten years ago. I, I was just a little pappy. I was just a little, just a little squirt. I said, grandpappy, I don't want to fish this lake. This lake sucks. Fish aren't healthy. Fish are dying. <laughs> I can't eat these fish. I want. I want. I want to fish a different lake. Now. now, can you swim this lake? No. No. Can't. It's too. It's too dirty. No. No. You can't swim this lake. You. You probably grow down your second or something. You swim in this lake. This here lake. Yeah. Uh, nasty for me. Now. now. When I get thirsty and I get right down to my lake, I. I want to drink it. But I can't. Why can't I drink it? That. That lake. It, it don't be eutrophied. Don't be so polluted. You can't drink nothing of that. You got to purify it. And purifying costs money. We ain't I, got money. I don't have the money to purify my eutrophied lake. It's too polluted. And you can't drink out of that. You can't no drink use. that one. What use does Lake Mecca toilet have anyway? That's what I want to know. 